Hey, Collective Hey, welcome back guys. Welcome back. Shout out to the entire YouTube fam. Shout out to everyone that has donated guys. Um, everybody that has booked a personal reading, thank you. I appreciate the love and the support. Um, if you would like to check out Mystic Sets, guys, the link is in the description below, okay? And don't forget, guys, next week is the last week, um, July 31st, that I will have discounts on the readings, okay? Give me some messages for the collective. Whoa. This is a lot. I'm not going to take all these. Um, we got four that came out. Okay, but I am seeing Earth Star activation at the bottom. Okay, this Isis energy is coming through. Isis and Osiris. Wow. Some of you guys come from an ancient Egyptian lineage. Wow, this is dope. We're seeing angelic frequency, okay? Angels are here. You are safe. There is a potent connection that you have with the divine at this time, collective. Wow, again, that Isis energy, that grounded energy, earth star uh, activation. Some of you guys are uh, could be an earth sign. Don't have to be. But whoever you are, you are very connected to source at this time. Naya. Naya. I'm sitting on you. Okay. I'm sorry, guys. I'm going to have to stop this and pick back up. <laughs> okay, collective. I apologize. I had to stop the video. So I don't even know what I said last. Um, so I'm just going to try to jump back in and, <laughs> you know, pick up where I left off. Okay. Again, uh, angelic frequency. Okay. I'm also picking up, um, your heart has come into alignment. Wow. This is beautiful. Your heart space collective has come into alignment. Wow, this is beautiful. Because again, God search us by our hearts collective. God is gonna search your heart space. So you can do something, right? You might do something with the wrong intention. See, you might do something and think you getting away with it. But again, God know your intentions. God searches us by our hearts collective. And God has searched you by your heart collective. You have come into divine alignment to be on this angelic frequency here. Again, there are angels all around you, okay? There are angels collective all around you, okay? You are receiving a lot of signs. There are a lot of synchronicities collective that is taking place around you. You're receiving confirmation. Some of you are seeing orbs of light, like a, I'm seeing specifically like a orangey almost, like not uh, so much red, but more so of a yellow, in between yellow and orange, you could be seeing like, spheres of light okay again this angelic uh frequency that you are on you are seeing man listen collective i can't even really go into i mean we could talk about this all day but i need to really get to the next card <laughs> i really need to the, to get to the next card but you are about to be rewarded with some sort of abundance you are about to be blessed with some sort of blessing at this time you have been making decisions that have been for your greater good, okay? And these decisions have not always been easy, collective. Wow. This is dope, guys. You are full of power. You are full of potential at this time. You have the ability to reach the stars, collective. Wow, this is dope. You are in alignment with your highest good. Wow, this is dope, guys. This is dope. I've been talking, in a lot of the readings lately, uh, frequency has been coming up. Frequency has been coming up. Again, for some of you guys, uh, you have angelic voices, okay? You have angelic voices. Listen, I'm finna go. Why is this on the bottom? Voice activation, angelic 
attunement, divine support. Listen, for somebody, your voice is angelic, whether you sing, whether you, you minister to people. Uh, it's something about your throat chakra. Wow, this is dope. Again, you have come into alignment, collective. There's something great that's about to happen for somebody. It was not easy to get here, though, collective. It wasn't easy to get here, collective. Come on now. Wow, this flipped right over. Memories of Atlantis, okay? And I'm also picking up, um, you know, it's like they about to see your glory, but they don't know your story, collective. They are about to see your glory, but they do not know your story, collective. It has not always been easy for somebody. You're being spiritually uh, elevated here with spiritual acceleration, progress. You are progressing. You are moving forward, forward. You are walking towards uh, your North Node at this time, collective. For some of you, you've reached the North Node. This is where the blessings are about to, um, you, you about to be showered with these blessings. Again, it's like the holy flow. Wow, this is dope, guys. This is dope. I'm also picking up, um, I'm also picking up with this Memories of Atlantis, I feel like for somebody, you might be connected to um, Atlantis in some kind of way. Or I feel like um, it's kind of like, see, Atlantis was kind of like an advanced civilization, right? They were um, ahead when it comes to this, I'll just say, spirituality thing, Okay. Um, the people in Atlantis collective were, were highly evolved. They had many spiritual gifts. They were telepathic. They were extremely, uh, psychic collective. And this is you. You are extremely psychic. You are, um, tele, you, you're receiving telepathic communications or you can communicate telepathically collective. For some of you guys, you are mind readers. You have the ability to, um develop something here i feel like you you're being called to create something to uh develop something to um integrate something collective for some of you um you are connecting with atlantis at this time there's a gateway you see this there's like a door opening here right that's almost essentially like a gateway, okay? And it's kind of like you're being connected with ancient Atlantis at this time. You're receiving blessings at this time, collective. Listen, you are, whoever you are, you are spiritually elevating at a, at a, at a much higher frequency. You've become aware of your gifts, okay? Um, I'm also picking up collective... Who, just stay in tune spiritually. Stay tapped in spiritually because there are a lot of blessings that you are about to receive. Don't allow the material things collective change your heart, baby. Do listen, whoever you are, you have something that money cannot buy. You have something collective literally that money cannot buy at this time. Money cannot get you on an angelic frequency. Money cannot spiritually elevate you collective. Money cannot buy a team of angels to connect with you. Again, you have something that money cannot buy. What you have is priceless collective. Wow, this is dope. What you have is priceless collective. And where is, hold on, let me find, let me think for a minute. Where did I see? Oh, here it go. Yeah, while we're talking about angels, uh, shout out to Ebony, okay? Minix Diva. You guys go check out my girl, okay? Angels everywhere. I'll leave the link, okay, uh, to the angels everywhere in my description. There are angels everywhere around you at this time, collective. 
And this book is about, as you can see, it says understanding synchronicities and their meanings. So I'm also picking up for some of you, you receiving angel numbers. Like you receiving like synchronicities of, of numbers. You might be seeing 111, 222, 333. So for some of you, this book would be very, very uh, beneficial, okay? Very beneficial. Because some, some of you, you're on this frequency. You're on this frequency. Yeah, stars aligned, okay? Stars aligned. You are navigating by the stars collective. Wow, this is dope. Some of you guys are star seeds. You are mind readers. You have old souls collective. You've been here before. You've reincarnated many times. This is not your first incarnation. Wow. This is dope. And this says chamber of the violent flame, karmic release, radical transformation. Radical transformation. There has been a radical transformation collective that has taken place within you because you come, you've come into divine alignment to be on this angelic frequency. Wow, this is dope, guys. This is dope. I'm really enjoying this reading. I'm also picking up for somebody now. This may not resonate with everybody, okay? But I feel like your the angels and your spirit guides are really um guiding you at this time or giving you some sort of guidance or or like encouraging you in some kind of way. Oh, excuse me. Let me drink something. Hold on. Okay. Um I feel like for some of you, you could be fearful about something or there just might be some sort of underlining fear or insecurity or something like that that you are dealing with. But your fear is being transmuted into love. I'm picking up alchemy. Some of you guys are alchemists. You have the ability to transmute energy. Wow, this is dope, guys. Collective, y'all energy been lit uh, the last two weeks. Wow, listen. This the only one that flipped over out of all of them that came out. So I'm going to take that one. <laughs> I'm going to take this one that flipped over, okay? All right, so let's get these back in order. Y'all know how we are about our cards. You know, we like them, like them lined up with perfection, okay? All right, so here we go. Anunnaki, okay? Anunnaki, light codes is here. There has been an energetic shift collective that has taken place, which makes so much sense with this angelic frequency. You, uh, you spiritually evolving. I'm also picking up etheric cords. You know, the energetic cords, your energetic field has been cleared, collective. You are receiving so much information with new information here. There, there are a lot of downloads that you're receiving. Whoever you are, you are very psychic at this time. Your psychic ability has been sharpened. Your gift has been sharpened, collective. This is definitely, you've. I feel like you've experienced um, or you've went through I guess, uh, a successful completion of a cycle. You're entering a new cycle. This is, a, it's like the rest of your life will, will not be the same. You are no longer the person that you used to be. The cycle has been broken, collective. Again, the cycle, collective, has been broken, this card also is connected with the Egyptian goddess Isis, Isis energy. I said that earlier in the reading, Isis energy coming through. Yeah, and it's kind of like, um, wow, so it's kind of like, um, you know what? I'm not even going to go there because that might really go over some of y'all head. 
I'm not even going to go there. I was really going to touch on this Anunnaki light codes here. And I think I am. Let me, hold on. Let me, we, we finna go to school real quick. Hold on. Let me get this book. All right. Let's talk about this. Yeah, because a while back, it's been a while when I first, I believe, got this deck and started uh, speaking about Anunnaki. Some people like emailed me uh, regarding this. So I guess maybe this is why I'm being led to really touch on this. OK, um, this says the Anunnaki are a race of cosmic light beings who have been coming to Earth since ancient times. OK. The div the divine leader of this incredible race is the goddess Ishtar, a powerful figure similar to the e G Egyptian goddess Isis, okay? The Anunnaki have taken many forms throughout the ages. They have an angelic, wow, they have an angelic warrior-like quality and have appeared with wings, sometimes up to four, and with an elongated head and face similar to that of an eagle, Wow, when the Anunnaki appear, it's important to know that they are heavenly allies collective. This is nothing demonic. Anunnaki, again, are heavenly allies supporting your healing uh, process, your healing journey, supporting your ascension, supporting your elevation collective. Wow, this is dope, guys. They value life, okay? The Anunnaki are um, beings of infinite light working, um, you know, with source, guys. This is this is nothing demonic, you know. Of course, do your due diligence, right? Do your due diligence, but um, there are like, like aliens, right? So now everybody finding out aliens is real, but who's really surprised? You know what I'm saying? So it's kind of like one of those things. There is some sort of great change that is coming to you collective, but you're going to have to shift your perception. You're going to have to shift the way that you view things. But I feel like you already did. You might have to let go of your old mindset, the old processes that you're used to, the way that you're used to going about doing things. You're being filled with new information here. Yeah, old systems. Uh, old ways of being, old ways of doing things have to be released in order for you to evolve collective. I'm also picking up some of you might be feeling vulnerable at this time because you might be in a place along your journey where you don't know where you at. You might be a little confused. You might be a little unsure collective. But it's kind of like you are being allowed to connect deeper uh, with your gifts, deeper into your feelings collective. Wow, you have a lot of potential. Some There's about to be some sort of great breakthrough. There's about to be a big breakthrough that you're going to receive, that, that you're going to have collective. Because it's like, Something is about to be reignited with this energetic shift. Again, with this radical transformation, you releasing this karmic energy. You are a part of the new energy upon earth, okay? You are a part collective of this new energy, this change that God is bringing to earth. We are here to raise the frequency, okay? God is love, okay? Uh, light drive out darkness, right? This is dope, guys. I hope this message resonated. I'm going to actually close out the reading here, okay? If it did, hit that thumbs up. Subscribe if you have not subscribed, guys. Um, and don't forget, keep up with me. My link tree is in the uh, description below. Thank you, guys.